Hello, it's Markham Matoshrich here from Markham3D.com and AussiesAndDragons.com. In this section, we're going to spawn an object in a random location. So first thing we do is up in the tar in class, we search in target point. I'm going to drop one here, drop one here, and drop one here. From here, let's open up the blueprint editor. So we're going to open level blueprint. So it's going to be very, it's going to be level specific. I'm going to grab these three target points click and drag them and dump them in there. Okay, let's compile that. So first things first, let's get an array, make an array, and let's add pin, add pin. Let's just add three of them in here. From here, we're gonna go event begin, uh, begin play. And from here, we're gonna click on spawn actor from class. And the class is going to be my pickup key, which is a default here, just a box with a sphere and a um, trigger box. From here, we want to select our transformation. So I'm going to, on the array, type in get, uh, get a copy. Let's do a um, random integer now. So random integer. That's not the one. We need a random integer range. Random integer range. And because we've got an array from zero to two, we're gonna go zero to two. In the bottom there, from here, we're going to get actor transformation. Oops. And so that's gonna be the spawn location. Compile, save, play. So the sphere's in the middle. Let's escape, play. It's on the left, play. It's in the middle, play. It's in the left. Is it gonna go right? No, it's gonna be a jerk, isn't it? There we go, it's on the right now. So as you can see, we're randomly spawning on the right-hand side now. There we go, we're in the middle. <laughs> Very straightforward. If you enjoy these short and sharp tutorials, please hit subscribe as I'm pretty much releasing one every three days.